99 here and um, I had to move locations because as you can see my city is getting full and I didn't have that space that I usually have but I have a table over here so let's go I should explain first that um, from November 25th to uh, for a while for till December something there will be the 12 days of Radamus well 12 Days of Justice, behind me. So basically, I will be reviewing Micro and um, some other stuff. All from the Justice League movie, which is very good, so you should see it. And there are two spoiler characters, I will tell you. Um, they're characters who come back, but uh, spoiler. It's a spoiler. So anyway. So here we have Flash, Cyborg, Aquaman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. Let's take a look at Flash first. Oops. So Flash is very cool. He is red with a yellow stud in the middle. And he's pretty cool. Um, I did make him glowy because in the movie he's fast and in the TV show he's fast. Um, I do have to say this one is a more funny version, a funnier version than the uh, TV show Flash. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, so today we're with, and then here is the first one I built, Aquaman. So, um, he has a green stud with a gray stud above that, for kind of symbolizing his belt or his quindant. It has five points, people. And then he has his gold t-shirt, and then he has brown hair. So yeah, these guys are very simple, but they're just kind of effects, guys. Next one up is Cyborg, which I was really looking forward to him in the movie, and he um, was actually pretty funny. He had definitely cool scenes. So he does have a red stud in the middle of plain gray ones. Just, he's kind of too simple. Him and, too simple. Him and Flash are definitely simple. Next one up is Wonder Woman, and she has a dark red stud. I don't know if you can see that. Um, light's pretty terrible. A dark blue tile, because she has a skirt. And then a red t-shirt type thing, and then brown hair. So yeah, simple too, but these guys do make cool effects, and if you don't have the sets, or if some of them are too expensive for your taste and you can't get them, uh, well, then you can just make these little micro figures. And they do look kind of recognizable, you can definitely tell who they are sometimes. Now it is time for the leader of the Justice League. Oh. I have to put that little gray thing so that you can tell that he is a black stud. And then for the cape, I just took a- Ah! Stop falling. I took, um, just a little normal black 1 by 2 piece. And, um, then some gray pieces below him. He looks pretty nice, in my opinion. So, yeah. That's Batman for you. Now, be warned, the next two are spoilers. Spoiler characters. Um, but one of them, you obviously know that he would come back. So if you don't, haven't seen the movie, well, you've been warned. Superman! So, yeah. Um, he was in the Lego set, so I built him. Um, and I saw him in the movie. It was pretty cool. He has black tie hole above him for hair. Red cape. And then two blue translucent sets, because, oops, because he is fast again. For the fast characters, I kind of give them translucent pieces to represent, like, well, but, uh, anyway, the next one is in the movie, but he is not the normal version of him, so you've been warned, it is. It is Green Lantern. Now, this is not the normal version of Green Lantern. There was a Green Lantern in the movie. Um, Stephen Wolf kills him. Sorry to say, but yeah. Um, so, yes, he does die, but um, it was just a quick death. It wasn't too bad. Um, but he was fighting in a big action scene with Stephen Wolf, and it was talking about, like, that gods came from above to help him. So, it's just leading on that there's going to be a Green Lantern movie. But the ring flies off to seek a new person. But in the movie, he does have his hammer, so he, I made a hammer. So it looks like he has a hammer. Just 
So we can go boom, boom, boom. Um, those from his ring. Anyway, he has a lime green translucent piece. Um, a lime green, normal stud, a white stud, and then a green stud. And I do have to say, I was proud of this one. Anyway. So anyway, those are the Justice League characters. We have Cyborg, Aquaman, Superman, behind Superman, Wonder, Flash, Wonder Woman, Flash, Batman in the front. See him better down there. And then Green Lantern in the background. But that is not the normal one that we all have been experiencing. That was just a random one. It was like... You know how he had that mentor? He kind of looked a little like him, but not exactly. So I do hope that we'll have a Green Lantern movie. I did put them on a tree piece just because it kind of looks good. Anyway, come to come back tomorrow for for the villains, Stephen Wolf and some parademons. And then tune in for the other 12 days for micro nightcrawlers, some um, micro fox troughs with Batmobile, micro bat caves, micros, other stuff. Um, and tell me guys if you like this because I may do this a yearly thing. Anyway, everyone, I'm Rodimus Prime. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to all your Justice League friends who complain about how much the set costs, and you can make these guys. So anyway, I hope you did enjoy this, and um, expect these guys in some skits, some stuff like that. And hope you enjoy the 12 Days of Justice. Ba la 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 bam.